All right, let's just say it out loud. Vaginas can get a little smelly, especially for women in their 70s. But before you get embarrassed, let's talk about why this happens and why it's actually a lot more common than you might think. First things first, as we age, our bodies change. That includes the vagina. Around menopause, usually in your late 40s or 50s, your body stops making as much estrogen, and by your 70s, that hormone drop can really start to show up. Estrogen is kind of like the body's moisturizer. It keeps the vaginal walls thick, elastic, and well lubricated. But with less estrogen, the tissues get thinner, drier, and sometimes irritated. This is called vaginal atrophy. With dryness comes tiny cracks in the tissue, which can lead to mild infections or just a different smell. Now remember, the vagina is home to billions of bacteria, good bacteria. They keep things healthy by balancing the pH and fighting off the bad guys. But when those hormone levels drop, the pH can go up. That means more room for odor-causing bacteria to grow, and less support for the good bacteria that usually keep smells in check. Other things can play a part too. For example, medications, diabetes, or urinary incontinence, leaking a little urine now and then, can all add to the mix. Sometimes, it's as simple as a change in hygiene habits or wearing pads that don't breathe well. But here's the thing. Most of the time, this is totally normal. It's your body adjusting to a new phase of life. That said, if the smell is strong, fishy, or comes with itching, burning, or unusual discharge, it's time to check in with your doctor. Sometimes smells signal an infection or something else that needs treatment. So don't be embarrassed. Talk about it, ask questions, and remember, this happens to a lot of women, even if nobody's shouting it from the rooftops. Your body's not weird, it's just aging, and that's nothing to be ashamed of. Take care of yourself, stay curious, and keep those conversations open.